Really excited to launch the uh, brand new state-of-the-art cyber lab here at Energis. This is the first for the area, a first for West Cumbria. I'm really excited to be working with the NDA. The Cyber Security and Resilience Programme has been instrumental in getting this off the ground. As we live in an ever-connected world, cyber security um, is a focal point on a lot of companies' um, agendas, not just large corporate organisations but small local business as well. So the lab's initially been used to engage our level 4 cyber security apprentices but that isn't the only reason. We want to engage with businesses and other local providers to really maximise the utilisation of the lab. The idea behind the lab is it's a fully immersive learning environment. What that means is that we can simulate cyber attacks without the risk of affecting our production network. It allows companies to come in, simulate cyber attacks, simulate it against their live business systems, get an idea of what it will be like to be attacked. The lab will also be used to support our STEM initiative uh, called Cyber First. So we're working in partnership with the National Cyber Security Centre to deliver Cyber First to the north of the UK. Cyber First is a pivotal part of the government strategy to get young people involved in cyber security, to give them the skills and knowledge to pursue a career within cyber security. Cyber has interested me because there will always be a need for cyber security um, professionals and as there is a skill shortage at the moment um, I just jumped at the opportunity that even though I don't have a lot of um, knowledge about cyber I will develop over time and hopefully we will be the forefront of this brand new opportunity. I think the um, cyber lab is very important for looking at the whole cyber security industry as a whole in the UK because the UK government had recently announced about 300,000 people were needed to fill the gaps within the industry. And looking at Cumbria itself, it's not really classed as a kind of sort of techie county rail, it's more like engineering based. So to have such a facility in the county is, is brilliant for it and um, it'll help the north especially to train its um, staff better and to help inspire young people to get in the industry as well. So my personal goal is to inspire young females into this industry as there is a, a major gap. On our apprenticeship right now there are two females and there are seven males. So hopefully as the cohorts go on more and more females will be inspired to be part of this industry. We're already engaging with a number of industry partners, businesses and providers across the north. We want to work with more people so if you're interested please contact us, we want to engage with you.